GLAPE, this is week number three, and we're back in Coach's Corner with Coach Laven. We're going to first of all talk about Healthy Highway 51. Healthy Highway 51, do you remember what the five means? Do you remember what the one means? I'm going to talk about my favorite fruits and vegetables. Two of my favorite fruits would be bananas and strawberries. And two of my favorite vegetables would be broccoli and carrots. But I like most of them. And many of them are good depending on the way you have them cooked. So hopefully you'll get your five fruits and vegetables in today. And lots of physical activity I'm looking forward to today. Uh, i got some fun things planned. Today is Rock, Paper, Scissors Challenge Day, and you'll do that a couple of different ways. One part with me, one part with a different video, and I'm looking forward to doing my part with you on that. Our targets for today are still the same we've been working on, to make sure we get as much physical activity as possible each day, and uh, also to make sure we have a safe activity space where we do our exercising. Make sure you have at least six feet or more all the way around you. Third through sixth grade, you have a couple of activities to do. First of all, you can do something called an activity log. You're going to keep track for one week the activities that you do and how long you do them. We will not do this every week. This is just something I want you to start thinking about to hopefully help you get in the habit of doing something physically active every day, whether it's for an hour or not, try to get something in every day, keep that body moving. The activity log is due by next Tuesday. You're also gonna watch a video called Believe in You, part one. It's about a person that overcomes some hard things in his life to accomplish some goals. You'll have a question or two to fill out regarding that. We're going to start on our warm-ups. We'll start with our with our jumping jacks, five of each kind. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Nice job. Skier jumps, we'll do ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. When we do push-ups today, we're going to work a little bit on getting a muscle tired. One way to do that is to do the exercise. Rest, repeat, rest, repeat. All right, and do that three or four times. If you never get a muscle tired, it never gets stronger. We're going to start with push-ups. Remember, you challenge yourself at whatever level you're at. If you're still working on just holding push-up position, hold that as long as you can. Then rest. Then repeat. If you're doing push-ups, do as many as you can. Then rest and repeat. So I'm going to do seven or eight just as an example. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. I'm gonna put my knees down to rest. Probably my rest would be about 15 or 20 seconds normally. I'm gonna go ahead and go back up and do another seven or eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Feeling good. I can get my muscles a little bit tired too. I'd rest again about 15 or 20 seconds and do another seven or eight. Or maybe if I couldn't do seven or eight, I'd do five, six, whatever I could do. You've got to get, get a muscle tired in order to get it stronger. Same thing with plank. Go down to your elbows, toes, hold it as long as you can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. If that's the most you can do, knees down. Take about a 15 or 20 second rest, and then do it again. I know that's not quite 15 or 20 seconds. I'm just showing you as an example. Knees up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
So you do what you can do, challenge yourself, go as far as you can go, rest, repeat, and do that at least two or three times. Now we'll move to our stretching. One leg bent, one leg straight. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Switch legs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Legs wide like the letter B. I'm going to go down the middle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Butterfly. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Nice job. Let's get ready for a little rock, paper, scissors challenge. It's just you and me. You and me. I'll show you how we're going to do this. First, first of all, there are going to be three different exercises depending on whether you win, lose, or tie. If you win, if you beat me, you're going to do five scissors jumps. Watch my feet. Front and back. One, two, three, four, five. If you lose, five mountain climbers. So you're going to put your hands on the floor, one leg in front, switch your feet, one, two, three, four, five. If we tie, if you do the same thing that I do, I want you to do 10 seconds of quick feet. Move your feet as fast as you can for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Don't count too fast when you do those. Here's how we're going to do the rock, paper, scissors. I'm going to count, put your hand out, have a fist. I'm going to go one, two, three, go. That's an example. Then whatever I show, uh, if you beat me, all right? Scissors beats paper, paper beats rock. So this is paper, this is rock, this is scissors. All right? Here we go, first round. One, two, three. Three, go. If you did rock, you beat scissors. If you bid, did paper, I beat you. All right? Do your exercise. Next round, here we go. One, two, three, show. All right, I have rock. If you did paper, you beat me. If you did scissors, I beat you. Do your exercise. Next round. Get ready. One, two, three, go. I did paper. If you did rock, I beat you. If you did scissors, you beat me. Do your exercise. Next round. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise. Next round. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise. Next round. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise. Next round. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise. Next round. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise. Last round. Last round. Can you beat me? Here we go. One, two, three, go. Do your exercise.
Hopefully you had fun doing the rock, paper, scissors challenge. I love that one. Uh, you'll have another rock, paper, scissors challenge on your activity stuff today. A little bit different than that one. Uh, have fun with that too. Hope you have a great day. Don't forget your assignments.